Good morning, everybody. It's Dave here. Saturday morning, early, cold out, a little no excuses mindset message as I come to you guys today after I just finished a tempo run uh, here outside in 28 degree weather here has them outside freezing with a hat on for the first time this year for a run here where I'm wearing gloves, um, pants, um, warm weather clothing. And, you know, I just want to share with you guys. So this morning, um, as many of you guys know, Kristen and I are doing a 30 day running program. There's um, a few days a week with weights and on the days with weights, there's also runs. So it's the best of both worlds. However, for those of us that live in the Northeast or those of us that live in the North of the country, know that this time of year it gets cold. And for me, you know, being a runner with the marathon before and running a lot of races, I didn't mind until about two years ago running out in the cold. But I think now that, you know, I'm completely bald, I'm in my 40s, like I love my home workouts because I can do them downstairs and the temperature doesn't change and maybe I just got used to it, but running in this type of weather is hard. And you know, this morning, Krista and I were like, oh my God, it's 20 something degrees. It snowed out yesterday. Um, there's frost on the ground, there's frost on our roof. The windows are frosted over on our cars. The last thing we wanted to do was go outside and run. Like right now, my hand that's holding this phone is cold. So maybe this message will be quicker. So I thought about it, but I reminded myself of this. We as human beings can do hard things. We have come so far in, in history as human beings and overcome so many things in life to overcome things. Like I think of this Tuesday's election day, we'll get through it, we'll figure it out no matter how divided the, co the country is. There are people that are, you know, difference of uh, d Democrat and Republican, we'll all get along, we'll figure it out. Like we can do hard things and I thought of, this morning, like, all right, David, we can do hard things. So go out there, you know, brush yourself off, get back on the saddle, lace up your shoes and just start. And why do I say that? Because I think it's the start, the start that stops most people. And it absolutely is. We, we think so long and the time we spend thinking, we probably could have been done with whatever it is that we said we needed to do, but we procrastinated for so long. And that's why the start stops most people. So you know what? I, I have learned that if we go on our emotions at the end of it is nothing, but if we go on principle at the end of it is a promise. And what I mean by that is if I go on my emotions, my emotions this morning um, did not want to do this workout. It was cold. I had a thousand excuses of why I didn't want to do it. I said, ah, I'll do it downstairs. I'll run on the treadmill. But I know principle says that by doing it, I will be mentally stronger and overcome things. By doing it, my body will thank me because I'll be physically stronger. By doing it, I will be a healthier person and that's better for my family because I want to live a healthier, fulfilling life. It's science, it's fact. We know exercise, we know do doing certain things is going to improve our life. That's a principle. Our emotions, at the end of our emotions, is often nothing because emotions come and go like the wind and sometimes we let the emotions get the best of us. So for me, I didn't let the start stop me and I went out here in the cold where it's below freezing and I got my my run in and I feel better for it so my thing to you on this Saturday is whatever you're struggling with in life whatever's challenging you right now maybe it's your health and fitness maybe it's stress with your kids at home maybe whatever it is I want to let you know this and guys hear me loud and clear every problem that you have faced in your life thus far every trial and tribulation that you have face this far, you have a 100% success rate, success rate of overcoming that problem. Why? Because you're still here. You are still here. So remind yourself that you can do hard things. Remind yourself that you can push through hard times. And remind yourself that at times, sometimes in life, we have to be willing what we don't want to do so we can live the life we want to live. So right now, I didn't want to do the workout. I didn't want to do the run, but I want to live the life I want to live of being healthier and feeling more energy and more fulfilled on this day. So guys, I hope this message was of value to you. Please, please like the message, comment below, share it with somebody, tag a friend, because I live each day. I live each day to help people break through that fear and adversity they face in life to play a, a bigger game in their life. Okay, so guys, have a great Saturday, and I will uh, talk to you soon. Bye-bye.